following my M03 custom buggy was a pretty good success. Uh, I'm going to continue on another project that I had started. So check this out. This is my Sand Scorcher Rough Rider, whatever it is you want to call it. It's got a few different names. Uh, what I did is most of this, or a lot of this car is made of aluminum. So what I did is I brought it to work. I sandblasted all of the aluminum parts. And then I clear coated them. It actually looks like I painted them silver, but that's not the case. This is actually the aluminum after it was uh, sandblasted. Well, I say sandblasted, it's actually glass beaded. So all of these components are now the same color. Well, that actually doesn't go in there. And I will be installing, let me get them out, if I can find them. have some carbon fiber cross members that I will be replacing these with. I still have to take these things out, they're kind of stuck in there. These are the only parts I haven't really played with yet. I actually had two of these. I traded one of them for a USA 1, which I also have to make a chassis for. So now I'm trying to figure out whether I'm going to keep this fiberglass chassis or if I'm going to actually install some aluminum chassis that goes all the way to the front. I've done the fitting if you will and it could work with a bit of machining. I just uh, realized it's a bit more work but it probably look a lot cooler than a fiberglass plate. I got screws that I ordered off of eBay. It was like uh, I don't remember. It was like a buck fifty or so per ten screws. All stainless steel hex heads, uh, M3s, hex heads. I've already got some installed on here. They look pretty damn good. So I still don't know whether I'm going to be installing a aluminum cross members. I just had a thought maybe I'll get some carbon fiber and use that instead. I have to see if I can actually machine the carbon fiber so it'll fit properly. And uh, we'll take it from there. There's probably going to be a few parts from Asia T's. Uh, probably shocks. Maybe a uh, bell crank of some sort from some other kit somewhere and uh, I guess I'll leave it at that for now uh, I'll update you when the time comes